on my usual content, but I've decided to take a bit of a break, and you know, that's fine. So, um, I'm gonna play Battle Cats, because that's what I've been doing. And why don't I sh tell you about some, uh, actually I don't know what I want to do. Let's just, well actually I should just fi finish off doing Sweet XP Insane with my XP slash Black Enemy loadout. And if you don't know anything about this game, I'm sorry. Get used to it. It's coming. <laughs> okay, so how do I actually, you know what, I should just put all my, all the things on so I can get the full amount of XP. Speed up, cat CPU, XP up. How do I do this stage? Actually, quite simple. Take off that, do one upgrade, spawn you, and then only spawn these two meat shields. And if I ever feel like I'm progressing too much, I'll just stop spawning them so that the gory black can, like, you know, come in and kill everything. But otherwise, I have to stay kind of light. So then you just stop spawning everything, and then yada 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 y'all coming uh, what <laughs> also don't look i also i'm totally haven't been uber carried the entire time i don't have empress chronos why would you be asking that at all i definitely don't have empress chronos i don't have the legit freezing goddess of everything no not at all Why would you be saying that? I mean, she is so amazing. She hasn't definitely carried me through stories of legends. Yeah, she is pretty great. Okay, let's just finish Sweet XP. Then this giant wave of horrible enemies come. D awaken Bahamut. Don't die on me. You can do better. I know you can. I'll need you for Bumble and Black that I already know how to deal with. I mean, since there's so much incoming money, the, um, uh, this CPU will just handle everything and spawn it whenever. And sometimes you accidentally cheese the stage and get 500,000 leadership and 30 cat food for first time winning. You know, nothing special, but you know, worth it. Um, oh yeah. I forgot. I need a. I'm planning on another. True form, trying to get Dancing Flasher Cat. Um, what should I do to show you I progressed in this game? Little Gross Awakens is too easy. I mean, like, no, it's not too easy. It's definitely too hard. You don't have to just spawn Awaken Bahamut, Holy Valkyrie, and then Consistent Spawns of Cyborg to beat the level. No, not at all. Maybe I should... Yeah, I, sh I know what I'm gonna do. It's not too hard, but it is reasonably hard. I'm gonna start working on Parthenon 2 Star. Or should I work on, okay, Sea Polluter. As Reggit says, and all by myself, because I, of course, look at Wiki, because I'm kinda good with shots. I mean, I don't think I'm horrible at this game, but I don't think- oh, sorry. I don't think I'm amazing either. Okay, LeBoyne. Uh. 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 Um, okay. Uh, Macho Lux is good with aliens. Let's just, you know, do some meat shields and cyborg. Um. Um, yeah, this will do. When we get to the Leboyne, we'll just have to spawn. What could work? Um, when all hope is lost, you'll spawn your good old giant Zeus. He is pretty amazing. That's gonna deal something. Um, we'll get Kronos. If anything else happens, we'll just use her because she can freeze everything. I think I finally have my loadout completed, and you may wonder why I don't have Awakened Bahamut in here, because I have completed Into the fa into the Future Chapter 3. It's because I just want to be able to handle with almost any enemy. 
Now you can deal with aliens, floating, um, red, black, angel, and in everything. And it's able to pretty much handle with any unit that comes across me. Oh, cappies! This is the level they first come in? Okay. I actually am quite good at this game because I have done a merciless enigma stage, so... Like, I don't know, but like, that's pretty good if you know what I mean. Well, honestly, I have like literally the best red loadout in the game. I mean, I don't own- I have Ice Cat, I Cat. Oh, whoa, oh no, 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 no. Oh no. Um, I'm gonna try it this anyway. I mean, I have I Cat. I was just talking about a horrible red level, so. As long as we have I Cat, we'll be fine. Cappies are kind of horrible. I've never seen the worst of them. And I mean, I'll just, I'll just see. I'll just, I'll just deal with them. I mean, I've had a pretty good run so far. I mean, I kind of got stuck in Battle Royale for some reason, but Scars of War were hella easy. Um, yeah. I, I just got stuck on one level in Battle Royale. Okay, yep, I'm gonna lose soon enough. I don't have any money. This is gonna go wrong. Okay, maybe we could... What, could, what should we do next time? I mean, we're not dead yet, but I mean, we're relatively gonna be there soon enough. We literally have nothing that can really deal with it except iCat and Empress Kronos, and they'll eventually die. The Cappies are eventually gonna chew through everything, and the JK Bun Bun's pretty much the same. Yeah, okay, we're gonna just see the boss HP and hopelessly attempt to meet shield. And are there more Cappy spawning? Ugh. Yay! Our little hope for survival is now gone. Also, I need to restore everything back to slow beam. Even though my slow beam is really not good. Ah, that's what I need to do. I need to go back to Otodo. And I also need to finish treasure farming for Into the Future Chapter 3. Ugh. this isn't gonna go well. Okay. Uh, I guess oil platform, now more of like, uh, blood platform. <laughs> hoi, 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 hoi. Okay. Um, equip menu. I need to restore all of these back to my horrible slow beam. I think they all are, except these two. Slow beam. Slow beam. And slow beam. Alright, to my red loadout, I I have an amazing red, red, red loadout. Kyoko and Cat, Kronos, Ice Queen Cat, Aruran, and I Cat. I'm not uber carried in this loadout at all. <laughs> okay, back to Sea Polluter. Oil platform, let's go. This should be a bit easier, I think. I mean, I have an edge on the enemy now. We have red units, and we're gonna use the Leboyne to farm monies. So you can bring out an onslaught that should easily crumple the enemy's might. Because, I mean, Cappies can't be that bad, can they? Maybe we should start getting an iCat stack. Because if we have the if we have things that can deal with the red, this should be a lot easier. Kyoko, Kyoko, when I started this account because I had a previous Battle Cats account, I lost because I was being a moron. Um, I guess, uh, here's what happened. Uh, I, there was Madoka Magica collab was going on, and I'm like, you know what, I have a great idea. I should just, I should indefinitely just, you know, try, I have these, all these rare tickets. So I'm like, you know, I'll just try at the collab, and then I did it, and I got Kyoko, and I'm like, okay. Is she good? Maybe she is, maybe she's not. I don't care, I want her. And now she's mine, so now I have a ton of the, uh, uh, yeah. So now I have, I have five Ubers, I think. Like, all of them have a weird story. Zeus's platinum ticket. Empress Kronos is, um, Empress Kronos, and I think I got her from best of best. Um, yeah, I don't really remember any other stories. Alright, meat shielding should be eventually able to kill these, those guys. And oh no, power creeping. How horrible. 
Leboyne shall kill everything and- Oh, what? Did that eraser cat survive? Okay, no, it didn't. Okay. Yeah, so it kills everything it hits, but these n long ranged Ubers, we should be fine. So we're going to want to sp spawn Ice Cat Lai first. And you don't even have enough money. Actually, just a good. Just actually, the two erasers should be good. Because one can get up there. Or we could go with this one. There's that one can move a bit quicker. Yeah, okay. This is, okay, now we're gonna just bring out Ember's Chronos. The LeBoyne shall die sooner or later. And then once it's dead, this video is gonna be like years long. Kyoko. And then we'll spawn a Ruin last. Because out of all of them, she's, um, we can use her. Also, I used to have Pyro Cat, but then I realized Kyoko takes this job. Alright, please don't hurt the base too much. Alright, one Cappy we can deal with. And Slow Beam, because I don't want Kyoko dying to some trolley vloggers, hey? Nice right, Cat, deal with it! Okay, I need you to freeze. Ooh, she got Kyoko got her weaken off. That actually could be useful against a Cappy. Is Ice Cat still alive? Did she already? Okay, wait, no. Did she actually already die? Seriously? Ugh. Oh no, not Bun Bun. All right, but we have Kyoko Sakura and we have a Ruin. We have okay, good. We got Ice Cat. No, I clicked on her. I need Ice Cat here. Ice Cat. Ice Cat. I mean, I Cat, not Ice Cat. Because if I fail at this level, I really have no hope. <laughs> because this this is the best red I can do. Maybe I could add Rogue Cat in or a better Knockbacker, but this is about it. <laughs> No! Kyoko! My favorite Puella Ma Madoka Magica girl! No! Don't leave me! No! Kronos got hit! But at least she got, like, repositioned, so that's good. This isn't going well. I hate you, Cappies. Even though I really know that this is a Bun Bun and Nyan. <gasps> we should learn. I have an ingenious idea, and I'm gonna let them come back to me so I can. What cat will deal with this best? Uh, probably Kyoko. We're gonna. I think the solution is Lore because the Niandum won't be a problem, and I think it can deal with the Cappies. Uh, am I just turning into a horrible Battle Cats player or not? Because I don't know. Okay, Kyoko dies in one hit. I should probably level her up some more. She's only 15. Right, how much does this red bun bun do? Alright, so he... Five hits the base? Something around that? Okay. New plan. We did worse. We power creep. Again. But this time we lure so that the bun bun can get near us. And we're gonna still have to send out Ice Cat early because her minute recharge time is freaking amazing. Alright, uh, so that's the little boy, and we just want to level up our worker and, you know, just send out these craze cats. To just deal with the incoming enemies. So... Okay, you these guys slash tiny weird children looking things need to die. And then, okay, 
the crazed cats will just naturally push through and now we're going to go into our next phase which is now adding in the eraser cat it's slower than it but that's purpose is to just be able to stay there and keep up i mean it stays at that staple location and yeah exactly what we want Hi, ah, and now it's just about stalling for monies. And this shouldn't be too hard from how it has been before. Yeah, the crazed cat rushes up and crazed cat rushes up quickly enough. And with the other cats almost there, the bun bun, the, not bun bun, the Leboin can barely move. Okay, so this is gonna work. And now we're gonna let it just naturally get closer. And we're only gonna spawn the tanks now, ain't the eraser. And then, we'll almost be enough for our power, no, we're not power creeping, I forgot. Instead, we just went to save up monies, and instead, what's our tankiest unit here? Which one could we really afford to lose? I don't know. I think I ice, ice cat will get out range. I'm just gonna do Kyoko because um, she's not she is very valuable to the level, but she's not too important, and she doesn't cost the most money. And now we're going to go into a full. We know she gets hit by but a uh, Leboin. Oh no, this isn't good. Okay, we need to rethink, or the Leboin is just moving closer. Don't know. But the Leboin should be very dead soon. Very dead soon. I don't want to power creep forever, you know. No! Stop dying! Does stop getting knocked back, Kyoko. Okay. Now we just want to leave her. Her recharge time is about a quarter in now. Luckily, she's been weakened so that when she does get the base enemy out. Which, you no, know, she does about 23k. That ain't horrible. Used to be better than my old Kronos. Alright, we're just gonna let her die, because if I remember, the things will just naturally start spawning. And we can do a power creep, so now... Hopefully... I remember this battle right. Because I really need to. So I can do a successful power frickin' creep. Okay, yep, this is not how it was meant. This is not how it works. Or maybe it is. Hey, I'm just not good at battle cats. I'll never know. Uh, let's just spawn another eye cat. Bam, bam. That should get perma frozen now. Oh, what? How are those trolley bloggers so strong? I don't want to send out, out any of the important things, so. And these trolley bloggers are so heckin' annoying. But the, it's somehow, okay, yep, now the stuff is spawning. Good. The bun bun's gonna spawn next, right? Not slow enough. When is the bun bun spawning? Also, how many knockbacks does that have? Okay, good. Now what we want to do is we just want to spawn everything. Now, we should not have to worry about that looming other creature that's all the way in the back. And we can just focus on the bun bun and these hella annoying cappies. Good, one's down. Alright, Ice Cat, do your job. Okay, you died. Okay, maybe this is working. You'll just need time with the bun bun. Time with the bun bun is what we want, right? Time with the bun bun. Okay, no, now we have the Niandum. Maybe I need to learn more. Or maybe I'm just covering up my horrible identity of being bad at battle cats. Or maybe I'm just gonna not go into sea polluter because 
this subchapter so far is very annoying, and I'm only one level in. Knock back, thank you. Getting too close. And I need Ice Cat. I love her. She was my first Uber on my old account. And I keep getting her for some reason. I think me and Ice Cat are just meant to be together. <gasps> no, not Kyoko! You horrible monster! Okay, at least my level 25 Empress Kronos is going to be able to hopefully kill this single-handedly, but I really don't think that's possible at the turn of the tides, and those Cappies are chewing way too fast at the meat shields. This is going wrong. Literally, this is the one loadout where I have everything almost at level 30. Okay, well, no, that's my alien loadout. And, yep, I don't think we're winning. But we had to have gotten closer. Right? I mean, 45, I mean, 44, 56. Uh, those cappies are too strong. 50, okay. I think we're either gonna just have to lure better next time, or, um... Yeah, maybe I should start working for Ice Catch you form. I mean, I actually am working for Can Can because I could use that and like blocking warps. That's so useful. All right, but now the uh, fried sh fried shrimp could be good here, but I don't know. That could be an iffy. Also, maybe I should try at that metal level. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. This is gonna be so long, but who cares? Steel Summit, let's go in. I've battled it before, I kind of lost, but I have a metal loadout that should work. Okay. We have Puppet Master to slow. Knock back. Another critter. Because this is all crits and it has relatively high weakening. And Catasaurus. And we can actually take you out because you're going to be useless here. And instead, do you have any super rares? Okay, no. And instead, we're going to try and Hurricane here. This Hurricane could work. I've tried this level before and it did not work, so. But Empress Kronos is great because she freezes everything except non-traded enemies. But she's still good for her slight amounts of damages. I just got Catasaurus recently and I'm kind of glad I did because... Luckily, fine. I have I have another thing that's not space major that can outrange outrange the um, super metal hippo. All right, and uh, this happened last time. Okay, yep. Yeah, I'm gonna retry and try and do some better meat shielding. Uh, don't look at all the random things I've downloaded. Uh, yes. Right. We're gonna just do better meat shielding this time. Eraser. Eraser. <laughs> Eraser. This is the plan. They're gonna die. And then what we can do is we'll just let the metal dude just chomp through. Not gonna deal much damage. And then what we can do is we can go beer and spawn in a Hurricane. And with some better meat shielding, maybe in a Catasaurus. Eventually, with the fast attack rate, things shall die. Okay, but we're moving in too fast. We're moving in too fast. I forgot about this. We hit the base and, like, we're entirely screwed. Yep, we are entirely screwed. Okay, let's slur. Oh, this isn't gonna work. Okay, but let's just try it. Empress Kronos block it, just spawn it. If we can avoid the deadly death of that metal one horn, I think we have a chance at winning. Oh, another super metal hippo? This is even Oh, this is a merciless stage. Oh, yeah. And that super metal hippo is gonna have like 16,000 health or like something insane. I think because it's 200%. Uh, Alright. Okay, well, I did red- I did the red one. Uh, okay, yep, that did not work. Um, I guess that's the end of the video. Um, I'm so good at battle cats. I mean, I 
definitely beat Oreo platform or like blood platform. <laughs> Alright, that's gonna be the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed this battle cats bonanza. I'm gonna do more of this. No, not equip. Actually, that's better. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.